Well, here's a startling health statistic. One in seven people have chronic kidney disease and don't even know it. Yeah, that's right. And ABC Action News reporter Anthony Hill is digging deeper into this health concern about what you should do to make sure your kidneys are healthy. For me, it started when I was 23 years old. And as with many patients, I did not know I had kidney disease. Maria Jimenez only started receiving symptoms two weeks before she ended up in kidney failure. So I went into the ER, they confirmed the diagnosis, and I started dialysis right away at the hospital. 30 million Americans are living with chronic kidney disease. And the disease is more common in Black, Hispanic, Asian, and Native American populations. Kidneys are responsible for filtering out waste, toxins, and excess fluid from your body, and kidney failure can be fatal. When you have chronic kidney disease, what happens is your kidneys are damaged and they don't perform that job well, which results, as you can imagine, in problems. There are five stages of kidney disease, and in the early stages, most people don't even know they have it because there aren't any symptoms. Diabetes and high blood pressure are the leading causes of kidney disease. When you have those risk factors, it's super, super important to be screened at least annually to make sure your kidneys are staying healthy and well. There are, however, symptoms of late stage kidney disease. So swelling in your legs and your hands, fatigue, uh, nausea, headaches. And Maria was on dialysis for nine years before finally getting a transplant in 2017. And it's been working wonderful since then. In Tampa, I'm Anthony Hill, ABC Action News.